Hey everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today, in the middle of our Christmas photos, which is why we're dressed up, right? We're not, yeah. we're not normally dressed up this fancy, especially on a Saturday. Guys, we got a box from BC Group. And this is going to be pretty impressive because this is a smaller size box than what I have received in the past, which means there's only one item that this probably could be. Let's go ahead and open up the box and see what we got. All right, here, can you hold that, bud? Yeah. Okay, there you go, got it? All right, I've got my assistant cameraman here. You should be my cameraman for more often. This this works out. All right. There we go, you gotta be really delicate because I don't know what's inside. Let's see, oh my goodness. Okay, okay, we got Shipping form, which all things do come with. Oh, cool. Lots of packing peanuts. So, ah! <laughs> all right. <laughs> I'm sure I'm going to spend the rest of my day cleaning up packing peanuts, all right? So, what is it? Oh, okay. It says Justin Barber, Better Biomed, IPA 3100. And if you guys don't know what an IPA 3100 is, we're going to find out together. Brothers and sisters, we are about to find out together. Here we go. All right. We've got that side. Got that side. So this is probably, if I remember it, the IPA 3100 is a new, yes, oh my God. Yes! Woo! Oh, it's so fantastic! And a little manual. Oh my god, guys, I love it. So this is the Infusion Pump Analyzer IPA 3100 single channel. Take a look at that. Oh my gosh, and, and this is the finished product. I love the metal handle. I dig it. Uh, we get some lure locks in and out. And... I've got the software piece, on off switch, and a power input. And it's definitely heavy, so that means it's battery powered. Take a look at that. And three, four, five. All right, okay. Very cool. So let's go ahead and let's take a look at the menu. Look at this. It's a, it's a beautiful menu, first off. But look at the fit and finish of this device. The fit and finish looks pretty fantastic. And there's a little hidden thing right here. Look at this, a stylus. This is pretty cool because, uh, you know, some of us have some fat fingers and let's try this guy, boop. Oh, nice. That feels, that feels like a resistive touch screen. All right, I'm gonna put the stylus back in there. Um, very cool, look at right here on the screen. We have the user manual, is a QR code. I really love that this company has been doing that because with QR codes, I always can access the manual and you know, I don't have to look for it. And the screen is very, very easy to, to touch. Um, so let's see, we got flow touch. Ooh, okay. Look at that, duration and condition. Nice, I dig it. And let's see, device under test info. So this is probably where I can put in, yep, the specifics. Oh, okay, so here's the keyboard when I type in an entry space. Um, it's resistive touchscreen, so you have to touch it a little bit more than you would with some other screens. But since you are going to be around fluids, it's probably a good idea that they went with the resistive touchscreen. I'm pretty sure that's resistive touchscreen. I can feel it. It's got like that plasticky uh, type of coating. And so when you're working around fluids with capacitive, um, you can get a lot of misreadings and you know problems with the touchscreen, etc. So let's go back to setup, okay? And let's go to home. So we have flow test, occlusion test, and drain. I like the little shadows down here. Um, the icons are pretty good. It says the IPA 3100 is draining internal chamber. Once all remaining fluid is drained, press done. So right now it should be squirty squirting some stuff out the side. 
and then you're just supposed to press done when that's over. So occlusion test, uh, we can do an auto occlusion test or a manual. Um, guys, I'm not going to go into these tests in this video because I clearly was not prepared for this, okay? So uh, I'm just giving a brief overview because I'm so excited that I finally got this product. But this, it is actually pretty tiny and it seems like it's extremely rugged. So the screen is a little bit recessed. So you can see it's a little recessed right there. Um, metal lure locks. I dig it. Everything, oh look, down at the bottom. BC Group did it again. Uh, so you got the calibrations and user manual accessory and all that on the bottom with the QR codes. Um, I dig it. So uh, my next step, I'm gonna do a video sometime in the near future where I actually take this guy and I run it through some infusion pump tests. Because when I test the infusion pumps, usually in the field, I'm only doing one, one infusion device at a time. And that's why I've always wanted something like this, because it's small, it's extremely portable. It's got rubber feet, so look at this, I'm shaking my whole table um, because of uh, the rubberized feet. Good touch there, guys. Um, resistive touchscreen, it's battery powered. Uh, I wonder how long the battery lasts. Interesting. Okay, well, let's see. How about that? I touched it, and it says I have 30 minutes left on this battery. That's pretty cool. I wasn't really expecting that. I just touched it just to see what would happen. But um, there we go. 30 minutes left on it. I'm going to go ahead and let this guy fully charge all the way up. Let's see. What do we have in the box? Wait, wait, wait. Here, bud. Can you uh, hold it? There yeah. you go. Watch your fingers. Thank you. All right. Let's go ahead and shut this guy off. Nice on-off switch. I like that. Let's put it right there on the manual. So this box is probably going to open up a wee bit easier. Yeah. With two hands. Okay. So in the kit, I have a syringe, some test tubing. I've got the AC adapter along with different plug options and the USB cord down in there. So there we go. That's pretty simple. Uh, different types of plugs for you know different areas of the world interesting okay that's all you need is just a lure lock kit with a syringe there we go all right guys i have to go back out and finish my christmas photos i just i got this box and i ran out as fast as i could i would like to thank my little helper right here mr seth uh for helping me out with today's video because he was following me. He didn't know why I was so excited to receive a box in the middle of Christmas photos. It is what it is, guys. So that is <laughs> the IPA 3100 from uh, BC Biomedical, BC Group. Um, neat little device. I can't wait to put it into service next week and see how it really runs. Let's do this.